Wow, it's a big 21. No one's ever been this close to one before. Are you quoting Top Gun? Maybe. Welcome to Chuck Yeager's Air Combat. And welcome back to another exciting installment of Chuck Yeager's Air Combat. Let's play by me. I am your host, L1011 Widebody. Continuing on our campaign in Vietnam. We're almost out of air missions, or historical missions. Air pirates, that sounds like fun. Bring down a B-52 and score your unit's 100th victory. Notice that these missions take place in 1972. There's a big gap from 68 to 71. Ah, just as his story... His story... His story was told by Chuck Yeager. I mean, as history would have. The U.S. Air Force and the U.S. Navy did not do a lot of operations between 1969 and 1971 when Nixon became the commander-in-chief and decided he wanted to bomb everyone that didn't look like him. Good luck. Okay. Good luck. You are a young North Vietnamese pilot. Cool. And your unit is trying to get its 100th kill. If you can get it today, it will auspiciously be on the 82nd birthday of Ho Chi Minh. Cool. Win one for the minner. <laughs> You're waiting on the runway when the alert comes through. A Yankee strike force is on its way. Oh, it's Yankee Doodle Dandies. It is approaching from the south and will be overhead in just a few minutes. Intercept it and bring down the B-52s before they can hit their target. And before they can release Rock Lobster and Love Shack. And I think that's the only songs they had. Anyway, let's go. Get to actually utilize the MiG-21 for its intended purpose as an interceptor. How about that? Take off. I'll make sure my target window's on. Uh, hey, look, it's on. Sometimes it isn't on. Ah, uh, okay. Nav one. Well, that's helpful. It tells us where the B-52s are. On full afterburner, we'll just go screaming demon to meet them. Oh, there's some F4s. I think their missiles suck. They sure suck for me when I was using them. F105. What are you doing here on fighter escort duties? That's ridiculous. Okay, we'll just do a high speed pass of them. Oh, oh, frig. I took some cannon damage. Oh, no. What is, my throttle is not so good no more. Only at what, 80% throttle? That's not good. Oh, I'm gonna limpingly take over this. No, this isn't gonna work. There's always next Thank time. Ha <laughs> Nice try, but remember your main job is to stop the B-52s. I was trying to do that, man! But then they started bringing out their guitars and everything. Fighters are just a distraction. Get in, take out the bombers, and get out. The B-52 only has a tail turret for protection. But that one packs four 50s. That would be four mod deuces. 
and sent more than one MiG pilot to the happy hunting grounds. Stay out of its field of fire. Well, how are we going to stay out of the field of fire when we have the missiles that shoot at them from behind? Well, we'll figure it out. Even on normal difficulty, this game is such a challenge. Okay. We need to go right at them. Turn our radar on, why don't we? So we can see where they are. I bet my target window is off again. Oh no, it stayed on. It's weird that way. Okay, let's try not to. Get shot by missiles. Ugh. Yeah, your missiles suck. Target to various. Try to get away from the F 105s. That one didn't even have a lock on me, I don't think. Oh, right to the vertical! Oh, goodness gracious. We're gonna get shot at from the tail gun. So let's not do that. But now we can line up behind them. Bring our screaming demon over. Oh, come on. Don't shoot at me, though. That's not nice. Watch my tail try to outrun this F-105. We should be able to do that. It's time for chaff. Come on! Fire the missiles! Oh, the missiles that suck, suck! Come on! Ah! Yay! I'm running out of ammo. I have no ammo. My gun got destroyed. Thanks a lot. Comrade Stalin, or whoever's giving me the money for this. My engine is damaged, too. Jeez. At least I have enough chaff to. I hope to God this is my runway. Come on, stop shooting at me. Ah! That missile exploded in midair. Okay, we're gonna. Scream it at one pass! Oh no! Oh jeez! Ow, ow! Come on! Don't shoot me while I'm landing! That's highly dishonorable! Frig! Friggin' the MIG! Oh, they're right on top of me. Where's my anti-aircraft fire? Lower your gear now. Okay, jeez Louise, here we come. Oh, just don't get strafed on the runway and die. Please, don't kill me. Oh, do I win? Congratulations. Ha! <sighs> that was harrowing. Thanks for not having any anti-aircraft defenses. Hmm. Good work. American pilots did a lot of complaining about how the North Vietnamese had everything in their favor. They could pick when to fight. They had an extensive ground control network to Major Tom. 
And all they had to do to win was to get the Americans to drop their bombs off target as you just experienced a North Vietnamese pilot facing off against fast-moving B-52s with fighter escort didn't have it easy either. Enemy planes down one? I thought I shot down two of them. Oh well. Missile hit ratio of 50% is excellent. Ha! Ah, the missiles... They fire, and they don't go into the things that they're targeting. They suck. Okay, as always, thank you all for watching. Until the next time, check six and be excellent to each other. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, or subscribe. You can also interact with me on Twitter and Facebook at L1011WideBody. And if you'd like, you can pledge to sponsor me at patreon.com forward slash L1011WideBody.